Oh, we're as good as dead. They say our provisions are almost gone. This weather is depressing. This does not bode well. Indeed. The anxieties and fears of the troops are an even more fearsome enemy than Guan Yu himself. Men with low morale are destined to become deserters. I think you both know what that means. Oh, it's General Eugene. He's scarier than any enemy will ever face. Master Eugene, thank you for the reinforcements. Showing emotion in the face of danger only serves to weaken discipline. I merely accept that grim reality. From here on out, we follow my plan. Understood? My blade of honor has not been broken yet. Come! Father! You must retreat for now! Eventually, we shall meet again! Hmm. Master Eugene, Master Peng De, the bravery you displayed on the battlefield has left me speechless. We are merely warriors fulfilling our duty. Our victory was a result of Shu's fragility and lack of honor. Hmm. Guan Yu will surely regroup at my castle. That is where we will face the final battle. It's no use. I can't find her anywhere. Now I'm beat. After having to fight all these battles. If we haven't found her by now, I don't want to think it, but maybe a foreign tribe... May I ask whom you are searching for? Yes, Lady Tsai Wenji. Huh? huh? Hello, everybody. Is something the matter? Yes, something is the matter. <sighs> We've been looking all over for you, my lady. Please forgive me. I was out taking a stroll looking for poetic inspiration. Fortunately, I was able to compose a wonderful poem. Huh? Here? Perhaps you should save it for later? Uh, Master Eugene, please go easy on her. Oh well, let's get moving. <laughs>